Hello everybody, this is Keith from Crypto Coin Mindset. I hope this video finds you well today. And in today's video, we're going to be talking the latest news articles on our cryptocurrency blog. And those articles include Bitcoin potentially getting back to its all-time high, Globe Derivative Exchange raises $3 million, and Cryptocurrency Exchange Bithum shuts down due to COVID-19. A lot of stuff to get to there, so let's kick it off. All right, welcome back. Now, before we get into our news articles, we're going to ask like we always do. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button tick that bell icon and click the all so you get notified every time we put out a great video. And don't be shy, smash up those likes. Hit them, smash them up. We appreciate it. It helps the channel. All right, in our first news article this week, we're talking about Bitcoin, the numero uno, the big kahuna, (laughs) at least within the crypto space anyway. Bitcoin has had a lot of price action over the last several weeks, and it has been slowly creeping back up to that almost 20,000 mark or its all-time high in January of 2018, following the 2017 bull run. So there are many factors that are kind of pushing it along, and honestly, recently, we've even seen it creep over the 19K mark, just under all-time highs. So what do you think? We are gonna reach all-time highs before the end of this year? I don't know. We could. There's increasing confidence in the space. We got a lot of institutional investors coming in. And these people, you know, they're going to buy. They're probably not going to sell. They're going to leverage just like they've been doing for years, right? They take your money in, give you a little bit of interest in the bank. And then what do they do? Lend it out to other people, leverage that money to actually make more money. Why should Bitcoin be any different? Heck, we can do it in the space. Look at Celsius Network, for example, or BlockFi. Links to join Celsius and to read this entire article are in the description below. And in our next news article, the Globe Derivative Exchange raises $3 million. Now, no one can debate the fact that DeFi has dominated the cryptocurrency space over the last year. And there are a lot of major players from various sectors who let's be honest, want to get part, get a part of this and get a piece of the pie, you know? So Globe Derivative Exchange said recently that it received $3 million in funding from the likes of Tim Draper, Y Combinator, and Pantera. Those are some heavy hitters. In an interview about this, Pantera's partner said, we're seeing a wave of interest in crypto assets from major banks, fintech companies, and portfolio managers. Well, of course they are, because they realize that the U.S. dollar is going to crap. But let's not get me off on a tangent, because this is about the news. You want to read more about this article? The link is in the description below. And in our final news article this week, cryptocurrency exchange Bidhum shuts down its local offices due to COVID-19. Now, you know, I don't care where you are in this world. All you hear about is this global pandemic and the issues and the rising cases and this and that. And I don't care what side of the fence you fall on with regard to the pandemic. You can't deny the fact that it's definitely changing the way businesses do business and the way we interact with businesses. And to that end, South Korea's largest cryptocurrency exchange, Bithum, which has been in the news previously, and we've reported on it for several other problems with their team and their executive group, is in the news now because they're planning to shut down some of their local offices, at least temporarily, due to COVID. You want to read more about this article? The link is in the description below. And that's going to do it for our news articles this week. We hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, make sure you share it with someone who might also get some benefit from it. And if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, I mean, come on, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button, tick that bell icon, click the all, so you get notified every time we put out a great video. And of course, don't forget, smash up those likes, hit them, crush them. We appreciate it. It helps the channel. Now, as we've been telling you at the end of all of our videos, we've migrated our YouTube channel over to Library. Library is a blockchain-based, decentralized file-sharing site. Link to follow us there in the description below. And check us out on Somi, blockchain-based, decentralized 
Facebook kind of style social media platform. We're just building up ourselves on Somi. So come check us out, show us some support, join Somi so you can get the truth of things without any kind of censorship. Again, we'd like to thank you for stopping by and visiting us here today at CryptoCoin Mindset. We hope you have a great day and take care.